How do I fit faith into my crazy busy life? Let's take a look at your Catholic planner for this coming week, the second week of Advent. Welcome to Catholic Planner, where we explore concrete ways of encountering God's presence in the week ahead by following our church's calendars of feasts and celebrations. We're already a quarter of the way through Advent. How has your Advent been so far? Has it felt any different? In this time of Advent, we think and reflect in a particular way on the life of Mary, the mother of Jesus. This coming week, we have two very special celebrations in the life of our church that are Marian, or in other words, have to do with Mary. The first of these celebrations takes place on December 8th, the Solemnity of the Immaculate Conception. Heads up, this is normally a holy day of obligation, although, of course, here in the diocese, we are still in a time of dispensation. This celebration of the Immaculate Conception remembers Mary's conception, when Mary came to exist in her mother's womb. As Catholics, we believe that Mary was born without sin, a free gift given to her by God to become a fitting dwelling for the unborn Jesus in his first months of life. Then on December 12th, we have a feast that will be very near and dear to the hearts of anyone from Mexico, or anyone who has ever been to the shrine of Our Lady of Guadalupe. Yes, on the 12th, we celebrate Our Lady of Guadalupe. The story is fascinating. One way you can grow in your faith this week is to click this link and read up just a bit on all of the marvelous ways that scientific methods can't seem to explain how God left an image of Mary on the tilma of Juan Diego. By the way, a tilma is sort of like a poncho. And if you really want to grow in your faith this week, you could even share this amazing story with a friend or coworker, especially one who doesn't practice the faith. Doing this would be extra courageous. That's your Catholic planner for the second week of Advent. May this coming week find us courageously living the gospel in new ways. Until then. Thank you.